So what happens if instead of throwing an object up, we're at you know the height of a tall building, let's say 300 meters, all right, and I simply drop a ball all right, from from there. Um, what we have now is, you know, general for what we might be interested in is point one is when we drop the ball, okay? And point two is when the ball strikes the ground. And we know a few things. We know that, that the height at this point, at point two, is, is zero. And we know, um, and the height at the beginning is 300 meters. We know that the initial speed is zero, and we might be interested in the final speed. We might be interested in the time between one and two. These are the sorts of things that will happen. So what is it? What is the speed time plot in this case look like? So we have a speed time plot. Here's time. We have speed. This is moving up. This is moving down. And at no point are we moving up. We are simply moving down. So we start here at zero and we move down. We have a slope of negative 10 meters per second every second. All right. At some time. So, the, so we have point one and we have point two. So at some t one, two, the area under the curve is 300 meters. All right, so where does this where does this get us? So the area under under the curve is 300 meters, uh, um, and this number here, the the height of the triangle, is the final speed of the object as it as it strikes the ground. So so from just the area of a triangle, 300 meters is equal to one half the base times the height which in this case is the final speed. But we also have another equation linking time and final speed, and that is just the line equation. Um, and so the final speed is simply negative 10 meters per second every second. That's just the slope times t12. And that's all of the, uh, um, uh, that's just the, and, there's, and the intercept is zero, so the initial speed is zero. Uh, uh, so if I wanted to put that in, kind of initial speed, but this one is zero, so we don't have to worry about it. Um, and now we can we can simply take these two and, and, and just do a little bit of uh, uh, algebra. So we so we take um, this uh, uh, term and we plug it into uh, in, into here and. Uh, and what we get is, <coughs> excuse me. Um, actually, I made a slight error here, and you'll notice something is going to something is going to uh, uh, happen if I actually do this. Um, so let me continue with the you know with the error, and we'll see how it, see how this goes. Um, so what I'll have is I'll have one half, and I'll have a negative ten meters per second every second. Okay, and I'll have a t one two squared. I'm going to end up with a bizarre negative number here with this with a with a square of time and that's not going to work. And the reason is because the area under the curve here is negative because it's under the curve. So I really should have put negative 300 here, negative 300 here because that is you know, for a falling object that is what we uh, um, that is what we get. Uh, so now we can we can multiply by two, divide by 10 and then uh, and so I end up with uh, um, t12 squared is equal to uh, 2 times the 300 meters divided by 10 meters per second every single uh, second. Notice meters cancels with meters here. And I'm going to get uh, 60, 60 seconds squared in terms of my units. Take the square root of both sides to get the time. So T12 is about 7.5 square root of second squared is a second so the units work out and i end up with my uh, um, uh, time for that to 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 fall i can then find uh taking that and relating it to the final speed that immediately gives me a final speed of negative 75 meters per second the negative part 
is because it's down. And so that, uh, so when we have the, the, the minus sign in, in, in here, the minus sign translates back into down, and that should be a, a check. Uh, and we can see that as I was going through uh, where I messed it up once with the position and then I noticed it and, and was able to fix it. And then it comes back, to, back with the speed and we end up with it coming down and that's the negative 75.